Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How you all doing? I hope you all are doing great. Yes, I am back with another interesting video I know you are going to love. In today's video, I'm going to be reacting on 10 surprising things that the Philippines is famous for. You all know I so much love to react on anything that gets to do with the Philippines. But before I proceed with this video, if you're watching me, you're new to my platform, you love my reaction videos, you want to see more coming from the Philippines, hit that subscribe button, okay? Don't forget to click the bell icon so you don't get to miss out each time I bring videos like this, your doorstep. So without wasting much of your time, guys, let's watch this video because I really want to know these 10 amazing things that made the Philippines so famous, okay? Philippines, you think of sandy beaches, tropical vacations. Now, I don't blame anybody, but that's not all Philippines is known for. In this episode, I'm gonna be sharing with you some interesting and surprising things that Philippines is famous for. I gathered a bunch of them for this episode. Hey guys, welcome back to FTD Facts. My name is Leroy Kenton, and in this video, I'm diving into a pretty exciting one. I'm gonna be uncovering 10 surprising things that Philippines is famous for, so let's dive in. Yeah, although that is something that Philippines is known for, the diving opportunities, no pun intended there, that means we're just gonna start the video. Okay, enough talking, let's go. For number 10, Philippines is known for its landscape of islands. The Philippines is famous for its vast islands, like there's so many of them. Like in fact, the entire land mass is actually made up of islands completely, making it the second largest archipelago in the entire world. There's approximately 7,641 islands that make up the Philippines, but this number That's may begin lot. to vary slightly with the raising wow. sea levels due to climate change. But there's still a lot of time to enjoy all the different islands in the Philippines. Now, continuing this episode with number nine, we have coconuts. Do we have any coconut lovers out there? Yes, I, I love I do. coconuts, coconut oh water, God. anything with coconuts. I love it, okay. Well, if you love coconuts like myself, you probably wanna plan a trip to the Philippines in the near future because there's a whole lot of tropical coconuts. The country actually produces and exports more coconuts wow. than any other country in the entire world. About 19.5 million tons of fruit is exported every single year. And almost everywhere you go in the country, yeah. you can find a coconut tree. Just watch your head though, because Ooh. coconuts can be very, very difficult dangerous once they fall from the tree. Yeah, I've had a few close encounters when I was a kid. I'm not Filipino though, but another island, Jamaica. We got coconut trees too. Palawan oh, is next. So, so the Philippines is famous not only for its islands, but also its beaches that sprawl along the immense coastlines. There's more to the Philippines, but I'll be getting to that. But I do want to take a look at the island of Palawan. It has been coined one of the best and beautiful islands in the world by some of the world's top travel publications, including Travel and Leisure magazine. It's definitely a great destination also for honeymooners all around the world. And the next thing to look at is Jeepney. Have you ever heard of this before? This one was new for me. Well, I, you gotta check it out. So the Jeepney, it's a pretty common and popular vehicle that's driven all around the Philippines. It's not your typical looking vehicle though. Most of them are colorful and they have various different design features on them that vary based on the person who owns it. The Jeepney was actually influenced by the design of the American Jeeps back in World War II that were brought into the country. Basically, just picture this, a Jeep with bright colors and fun riding all across the Yay. front of it. Yeah, pretty unique. Yay. Number six, Philippines is known for basketball. Now, I used to play a lot of basketball when basketball? I was younger, and man, my Filipino friends, they knew how to play ball. I think this was largely due to the fact though that Philippines has a history of basketball. The Philippines Basketball Association was Asia's first ever basketball league and it was founded back in the year 1975. This Filipinos, they definitely love their basketball and I'm speaking from first-hand wow. experience playing with Filipinos. Now it's quite common to see basketball 
basketball courts and many people rocking their favorite NBA jerseys throughout the country as well. And yeah, they're known for their love of basketball. So we saw five wow, things gosh. that Philippines is famous for. We got on number five, we have languages of the Philippines. Yeah, so the country boasts more than 150 languages, approximately 171 living languages to be exact. Not only is the Philippines incredibly diverse and home to an abundance of different cultures, but the amount of languages that are spoken and that vary from province to province is pretty incredible because the Philippines like I mentioned earlier is an archipelago and it's quite common for each island to have its own native tongue and unique history so if you're ever curious to travel to the Philippines don't worry about language barriers because English is most commonly the second language for most people and it's super easy to communicate and get around anyways so yeah another unique aspect of the Philippines okay now number four Four brings us to Catholicism. Now, as I was learning about different world religions, I actually discovered that Hello, Philippines please. is very well known for this. The Philippines is the hub for Catholicism in all of Asia. And like me, you're probably wondering why this is the case. Well, how it goes is like this. Spain ruled the country for 333 years. And with that, time. much of the influence from European nations came in. So of course, that was bound to change the cultural makeup of the country. And in 2015, when Pope Francis went to visit the Philippines, approximately 6 million people attended the outdoor mass. So you can see Filipinos are very devoted to their religion of Catholicism. Number three, let's look at the underground river. Palawan, the Philippines' largest island, is home to one of the longest underground rivers in the world called the Porto Prinsa Subterranean River. Now this river is now protected as a UNESCO World Heritage Site and it's home to a variety of flora and fauna as well as an extensive underground cave system that is open to the public to go and explore. Lore. Next up, let's look at the largest pearl. Here's something that Philippines is famous for and they're proud of it too. How much do you think a very rare pearl would be worth anyways? So this is interesting because the Philippines had the world's largest pearl discovered in it. And when they found it, it was in the Palawan Sea and it weighed 75 pounds and the value was a hundred million dollars. Cha-ching! And the final surprising thing that the Philippines is known for is that they're actually the tech capital of the world. Filipinos are actually known for being quite social, not wow, only in person, so but also online. You don't believe me? Well, it's estimated that Filipinos send about 400 million texts per day, adding up to a total day. of 142 billion texts per year. And just to put that into perspective, that's more than the number of text messages sent daily in the United States and Europe mm -hmm. combined. Mm -hmm. All right. Honestly, this is so interesting. The text message got me. Oh my God, that's a huge number. Philippines, you guys are so amazing. Honestly, you are packed with a lot of things. I don't know you play basketball as well. Oh my God, and lots of coconuts. I love coconuts so much. <laughs> All right, guys, let me know what you think about this video in the comment section anyway. If you're new to this platform, you love my reaction videos, you want to see more coming from the Philippines, hit that subscribe button, okay? Don't forget to click the bell icon so you don't get to miss out each time I bring videos like this in those days. See you all on my next one. Bye.